Hey guys, welcome back to Ethan's Greatest Life. Today, I'm back with another art video. And, uh, yeah, make sure to stay until the very end, because I have a surprise at the end. But uh, for now, let's get into this art lesson. piece of paper in front of you and something to draw with. I'm using a marker and let's just get into this. So first, right here at the bottom corner of my paper, um, you want to have your paper like this. So right here, we're going to draw an upside down U shape like that. Good. So now, I want to draw another one beside it, like that. Now we can connect the bottoms. And we're drawing an igloo, so now let's draw this, like that. Boom, boom, and boom. There. So we've got stripes, and now they look like ice blocks, because igloos are made out of ice blocks. So now we're going to start here, and we're going to draw a big U-shape that comes all the way over there. Now let's connect this to there. Like that. There, we have the shape of our igloo. We can actually... Draw another line right there. Like that. You can get even more creative and draw blocks in there. There. Now it looks 3D. So now we're going to draw lines coming over like that. So these are big ice blocks. When humans lived in the South or North Pole, um, in the Stone Ages, they would live in igloos instead of caves. And they actually still do now. There we go. So now, here's the next technique. We're actually only not going to just draw the line going straight down. We're going to draw one square at time because right here we're going to draw a line coming down in the middle of the squares like that so we're going to repeat that until the whole igloo is filled our igloo. Now like I said, watch till the very end. Now this part I'm going to fast forward. No, it isn't coloring because, well, an igloo is white, right? So um, I'm going to do this. Speed it up just like I did. Okay, that was the surprise. This has gotten turned into a craft. But don't you think it's just looking a, a little plain? It's just like an igloo. It's just sitting there. So do you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to... I'm going to use oil pastels. These are not crayons. Um, my very little sister, Vanna, likes to eat, thinks these are food. <laughs> she always just, like, so quickly just, yum. <laughs> so, um, yeah, don't 
these these are not food. <laughs> First, let's get our yellow, and we're gonna draw a circle in the corner, right here. Now let's color in that circle. Perfect. It's all colored in. Now, like all all suns that you draw, we gotta draw lines, so we can draw. Big, small, 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 big, and small. There we go. Now, uh, there isn't just a sun in the sky. We gotta draw some clouds. So let's get our white. Uh, my yellow pastels are a little dirty because they've been used a lot. We're gonna draw clouds now. So let's draw small one right here maybe one right here one right here and one more right here good now let's color in all those clouds crayons will actually work too if you don't have oil pastels but if you order them we have finished drawing cutting gluing and adding extra details to our igloo. I hope you enjoyed this lesson. If you did, hit that thumbs up button, no smash it. If you're new to the channel, make sure you're subscribed. If you're new to the channel, make sure you subscribe. Even if you're not new, if you haven't yet, make sure you subscribe. Because this channel is awesome. Bye guys.